Today on MTG Unpacked, it's time for a double dose of chaos. That's right, we're cracking open two of these mystery boxes for patrons. These are my vision for how a chaos mystery box should be. So let's introduce the patrons. We have Jonathan Heffercamp and Benjamin Sullivan. Okay, so we're going to roll for Jonathan first. So one through five, number four, that's this one. And then we have four left. Roll for Benjamin. Okay, one here. And the rest will open in future videos, so stay tuned. Alright, so let's get into it. Jonathan Hoferkamp, thank you for being a patron, sir. And the theme this month, as you might have guessed from Bontu on the playmat there, is an Egyptian theme you will see momentarily. Okay, so we have Modern Horizons, Core 2021, Guilds of Ravnica, aha! Uh -huh. Here we go, Invocations are the theme this month. We've got Theros Beyond Death, Throne of Eldraine, and Ikoria. So let's just do things in this order, I think that'll be good. And take a look at this fantastic foil here. Uh, unfortunately, they're a little bit hard to read with the font there, but we're going to do our best. Okay, so, ooh, look at that. So this is Lord of Extinction. So it's a creature, elemental, um, star, star for five. I had to have a closer look there. Lord of Extinctions, power and toughness are each equal to the number of cards in all graveyards. Nice. Fantastic foiling on that one. So set that aside and get stuck into the pack. See the patrons get the rares, mythics, foils and anything over a buck. So let's see what we can get for Jonathan today. We start off here with a human soldier. Thornwood Falls, a foil. Is that a foil? That is a foil. Move the lighting here. Here we go. Rugged Highlands. Okay. And a mythic. And not just any mythic. Fiend Artisan. Holy cow. Creature Nightmare 1-1 one, one for 2. So it gets plus 1 plus 1 for each creature card in your graveyard for X. And either black or green. Tap second of the creature. Search library for a creature card with command. Man across that. So let's put it onto battlefield. Then shuffle your library at vets. Really only any time you could cast a sorcery. Fantastic pull. One of the best cards in the set. Next up we have Mystic Subdual. Weaponize the monsters. I don't think that's a good idea. Zenith Flare. If you miss the deck tech with this one, I'll pop a link up in the corner. Flinging. I think it was like 40 damage or something. Or doing 40 damage to people. Craziness. And Common Survivor's Bond. Whisper Squad. Ranath Healer. Hampering Snare. Divine Arrow. Convolute, Day Squad Marshal, Pyro, Ceratops, Night Squad Commando, and that is it. Okay, on to El Drano. Okay, no pull tab here, just the regular cracking open. Oh, wait, we have Fairy Guide Mother, Run Away Together, Rose Thorn Acolyte, Lash of Thorns, Garenbrig Paladin, Dwarven Mine. Weapon Rack, Brimstone Trebuchet, a Golden Egg, Tall as a Beanstalk, and the Uncommon Spinning Wheel, Lock Dragon, Frogify, and the rare is Return of the Wild Speaker. There he is, Garrick. Instant for five. Choose one. Draw cards equal to the greatest power among non-human creatures you control, or non-human creatures you control. Get plus three, plus three, and two end of turn. The curse is broken, and Garak is free. There we go, forest, and a food token. So, moving on, Theros Beyond Death. And which of these sets is your favorite? Leave a note in the comments, and you know I'm going to go nuts now, because we've got a goat, yes, Jonathan. You get the goat, sir. Fantastic, one of the best pieces of artwork in the set. We get a mountain and a raster of the endless web, legendary enchantment creature spider, three five for four with reach. So whenever an opponent casts an instant or sorcery spell, create a one two green spider creature token with reach. All right, uncommons heroes of the revel, banishing light, whirlwind denial, and the common satyrs cunning triton wave rider, Arurus's blessing, Heliod's pilgrim, omen of the sea, Nalia's huntmaster, temple thief, pious wayfarer, satessan training. Lamphead of Death's Vigil. 
And you might have noticed on this channel, we look at the common cards. What is up with that? Well, it's very much a focus on the artwork here and getting the best look at the cards you can. So I hope you enjoy. All right, Guilds of Ravnica. We have Sworn Companions, Wall of Mist, Wojek Bodyguard, Barters and Bats, Portcullis Vine, Pause for Reflection, Rosemane Centaur, Garrison Sergeant, Deadly Visit, and Uncommon Swarm, Good Mage, Book Devourer. That used to be me, but I have not done much reading at all lately. Lately, we got a split card, Discovery and Dispersal. And the rare is Niv Mizzet Paran, Legendary Creature Dragon Wizard 5546. This spell can't be counted, has flying. Whenever you draw a card, Niv Mizzet Paran deals one damage to any target. And whenever a player casts an instant or sorcery spell, you draw a card. Good one. And a foil veiled shade with an is it good gate or isn't it? And a soldier onto core 2021. Hunting for Liliana. Where are you, Liliana? Let's see if we can pull a Planeswalker in this pack. I'd settle for anyone, really. We have Burn Bright, Rambunctious Mutt, Capture Sphere for all your Pokemon collecting needs, and Mackay Ogre, Portcullis Vine, Alchemist Gift, Skeleton Archer, Anointed Chorister, Mistral Singer, Infernal Scarring, and the Uncommons Witch's Cauldron. Waker of Waves, Bolt Hound, and the rare Heroic Intervention. Good on you, Ajani. Instant for two. Permanent two control gain. Hexproof and indestructible until end of turn. And a forest. And angel token. That's pretty cool. I'll check that in as well. Any Ajani fans in the audience, leave a note in the comments. Okay, Modern Horizons. Still, still, still hunting. For Ren and Stimpy. I think I'm cursed at this point. Okay, we've got a zombie. Um, 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 watch it for tomorrow. Yep, that's the one. I knew that. Snow covered forest. Whoa, holy moly. A foil tranquil thicket. Okay, I'm surprised here. And the rare. Yes, what a surprise. Tectonic reformation enchantment for two. Each land card in your hand has cycling red. That's fun. You can cycle it for two. <coughs> An Uncommon's Everdream, Valiant Changeling, Sling Gang Lieutenant Creature Goblin. I like the artwork there. Hilarious. He's got a slingshot there. Uh, Shelter, Reign of Revelation, Gilded Light, Trumpeting Herd, Headless Spectre, Treetop Ambusher, Viashino Sand Sprinter, Recruit the Worthy, Scour All Possibilities, and that is that. Okay, so we'll set these aside for Jonathan. Some fantastic pulls here. All right, moving on. Benjamin Sullivan. Okay, let's get into it here. Thank you for being a patron, sir. And I'm curious what we've got left here as far as the invocations. Okay, Modern Horizons Core 2021, Ravnica Allegiance. Okay, that is pretty cool. Guilds, War, and Ikoria. So this time, let's do things, do them in order, right? Release order, I think that's right. Apart from uh, the top two. All right, so let's take a look here. If I can read this. Chain Lightning, look at that sorcery for a single red. Chain Lightning deals three damage to target creature or player. Then that player or that creature's controller may pay two red. If the player does, he or she may copy this spell and may choose a new target for that copy. Okay, there we are. Very nice foiling indeed. <clears throat> Tuck that in there. All right, let's get cracking for Benjamin. Core 2021. Let's see it. We've got Defiant Strike, Ranger's Guile, Crypt Lurker, Short Sword, Goblin Arsonist Creature, Goblin Shaman. Yes, we love the goblins indeed. Daybreak Charger, Rookie Mistake, Mind Rot. You watch too many videos on this channel, you rot your mind. And discard two cards, but it's all good. Keep on watching, and that will clear right up. 
or at least that's what they tell me. And you will get the mine rot there, Benjamin. Enjoy. Scorching Dragon Fire, Traitorous Greed, Havoc Jester, Shipwreck Dowser, and a Mythic Massacre Worm. Nice! Creature Worm 6546. Six. So when it ends the battlefield, creatures your opponents control get minus two, minus two, and two end of turn. Whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, that player loses two life. All right, some very nice pulls today. And a foil Defiant Strike with a Jungle Hollow and MTG Arena card onto Ikoria. <clears throat> I've got the pull tab here. So everything is back to front. We've got a Human Soldier, a Forest, a Foil, Raking Claws, and the rare is Eerie Ultimatum. Sorcery for, what is that, seven? Return any number of permanent cards with different names from your graveyard to the battlefield. And Uncommons, Void Beckoner, Creature Nightmare Horror. Very nice, Boneyard Lurker, Proud Wild Bonder, nothing like a Pokemon and its trainer. Isn't that a beautiful sight? Spell Eater Wolverine, Moscow Goria, Plummet. Crustacean, Perimeter Sergeant, Boot Nipper, Dark Bargain, Ferocious Tigerilla, Patagia Tiger, and that is it. Pop these over here. Onto some guilds. So, hunting for shocks as always. Okay, we've got Rubble Belt Boar, Skyline Scout, Passwall Adept. Maximize Velocity, Bartizan Bats, Portcullis Vine, Parhelion Patrol, Boros Locket, Siege Worm, Goblin Electromancer Creature, Goblin Wizard, nice one. Demotion for the Uncommons Conclave, Cavalier, World Soul Colossus, and the rare split card, Response and Resurgence. So Response is an instant for two, deals five damage to target, attacking or blocking creature, Resurgence is a sorcery for five. Creatures you control gain first strike and vigilance until end of turn. After this main phase, there's an additional combat phase, followed by an additional main phase. Okay, that's interesting. Demir, Guildgate, and a soldier token. On to Allegiance. Let's see if we can get a shock this time round. And my voice is failing me due to the goblins. Okay, we have a Civic Stalwart Quench. Rubble Slinger, Impassioned Orator, Open the Gates, Thirsting Shade, give him a drink, the poor fellow, Aeromunculus, Rakdos Locket, yes, we do love the Rakdos Guild, Chillbringer, Gateway Snake for the Uncommons, High Alert, Cavalcade of Calamity, and the rare is Unbreakable Formation, Instant for three. Creatures you control gain indestructible and turn of turn has addendum if you cast a spell during your main phase. Put a plus one plus one counter on each of those creatures and they gain vigilance until end of turn. And a foil rare lumbering battlement creature beast four five for five with vigilance. So when it ends the battlefield, exile any number of other non-token creatures you control until it leaves the battlefield, and it gets plus two plus two for each card exiled with it. And a Rakdos Guildgate with a Sphinx token. On to War of the Spark. Hoping for a rare or mythic planeswalker. Okay, we got a Raging Crunch. Gideon's Sacrifice. Teferi's Time Twist. Vivian's Grizzly. Spark Reaper. Avon Eternal. Burning Prophet. And Obnixus's Cruelty. Jaya's Greeting. Hello there, sir. Totally lost. And Uncommon Cyclops, Electromancer, Elite Guard Mage, Kiora, Behemoth Beckoner is your Planeswalker. And it's a Mythic, Niv-Mizzet Reborn. All right, he's coming back for seconds. Legendary Creature Dragon, Avatar 664, every color of the Magic Rainbow. is flying when he enters Badfield. Reveal the top 10 cards of your library for each color pair. Choose a card that's exactly those colors from among them. Put the chosen cards into your hand and rest from the bottom of your library in a random order. The Plains and Citizen token. Okay, final pack magic. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Hit the subscribe button for more Magic the Gathering unboxings. And be sure to tap the notification bell to be notified as soon as new videos are released. 
Okay, we have a soldier non-foil lightning scalamental snow covered plans and you just know I'm going to slow roll it. Yes, I am. Okay, let's look at the uncommons first. We have Watcher for Tomorrow, Fact or Fiction, Lanoir Tribe, Commons Igneous Elemental, Amorphous Axe, Savage Swipe, Nature's Chant, Ransack the Lab, Tree Folk Umbra, Chiller Pillar, Quatefoot Cyclops, and Trust Oh, two more, Trustworthy Scout and Fairy Seer. <coughs> so What's going to be the final card? Will it be a big finish? It is! Archmage's Charm. Instant for three. Choose one. Counter target spell. Target player draws two cards. Gain control of target. Non land permanent with command mana cost one or less. All right. So there we have it. Got a couple of mythics today. Very cool indeed. Pop these in here for Benjamin. Hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Thanks for watching and have a great day.